The overall goal of this procedure is to identify alterations in locomotor or seizure behaviors in Drosophila. This is accomplished by first separating the flies into individual vials without using anesthesia. Next, a simple webcam is used to record the fly's movement. The data are then imported into image J to begin the analysis. Finally, custom-made fly analysis software is used to determine the distance, velocity, and duration of movement during the recording period. Ultimately, this assay can show changes in locomotor or seizure behavior that are associated with genetic and pharmacological manipulations. Now, this low-cost recording technique that we're going to describe can be used to both uh, analyze seizure behavior and locomotion in uh, fruit flies. In particular, we've used it to identify uh, genetic and pharmacological manipulations that modify seizure behavior in these flies. Today, Chris Berner, an undergraduate research assistant in my lab, will be demonstrating this technique. To begin, set up the webcam that will record the flies during the locomotor and seizure assays. Once the camera is in place, open the handy AVI software program to adjust the recording settings. Select the Time Lapse Images option under the Capture tab and when the new window opens, select the webcam as the capture device. For most experiments, a video frame size of 640 by 480 is adequate. Under the compression option, select the Intel IUV codec and set the seconds per frame according to the assay. Under the Advanced tab, create a bitmap